okay? <laughs> I must be the luckiest man alive! He's definitely dead now. One second he was there talking to us, and the next is... Got a massive boner. Are we gonna get rid of it? Grab that book. Try giving it a whack. <clears throat> He's got a boner. Whose fault was this? It was no accident. You were the one that dragged him down, and you're the one that's gonna bring him back in one piece! Because if you don't, I'm going to fuck you, baby. I'm going to fuck you harder than you have ever been fucked before. Do you understand me? Yeah. Why do they call it a cockpit? Is it anything to do with it having cocks in it? Sometimes. What's that do? <laughs> Can someone help me, please? If we don't get Luke's body back to London before it goes mouldy, Henry's going to actually kill us, isn't he? Quite possibly, yes. Are you guys OK? Want to have a threesome with me and my mate? She's pretty filthy, too. That's OK, I don't discriminate. It's all going to be fine. We've got it all under control. Drugs, he's going! We put something in your truck by mistake. It's a box. It looks like a penis. Your friend is in a penis-shaped box. A penis. Gold penis. I'll just quickly introduce you to my mother. Hello. You are fucking kidding me. Hi! What are you doing, you don't I'm Do you like Australian women? Sure. You know what it is. My friend's dead. And the only chance of getting him back home is if you go and shag that old lady over there. Woo! Oh, one my nipples! Hello. Oh, don't snap it! <laughs> Should we move a bit further away? Huh? Do you regret saying I'll do the eulogy? Neil, have a take on this bagel. Neil, just calm me down. I mean, it's really fucking powerful. Luke and I were friends for many years, and of everyone I've ever known, he definitely had the biggest cock. <laughs> hearts. I, I was meant to say biggest hearts. <laughs> <laughs>